welcome back to my channel you guys first of all if you guys are new here my name is zaria and if you're returning hey babe so you guys welcome to another vlog so today is thursday you guys and it is currently 2 45 p.m so of course i'm gonna go pick up carter and then after i went and got him i went to the beauty supply store because i really just needed a bunch of products y'all because i have a bunch of wig claps coming up and stuff and i just kind of want to go and stock up on my supplies because i be trying to be cheap i be going to the hair store getting like the little miniature size like girl be for real you're gonna use this in a week so i went over there i got some stuff so i'm gonna show you guys what i got to be the supply store i also went by burlington i was gonna vlog but um my camera lens was so dirty and i didn't have anything to clean it with and i don't like when like the little lens of the camera looked like foggy just nasty got fingerprints everywhere so i was like eh, i'm gonna leave the babes in the car so i left y'all in the car but let me show y'all what i got from the beauty supply store because i need to do my hair first thing i got i got these little black wig caps for carter because y'all know this is what i use on his hair at night time to tie it down this is my first time ever trying some lace tint because usually i don't do lace tint i just do makeup and be done with it but i kind of wanted to step it up you know do it and be a little bit more professional if you're gonna be you know styling these people wigs and things so i got the even tinted lace mousse and i got it in dark brown now i i was like asking them if i could like open it and like you know see what it was giving but that was like oh that is so dark <laughs> hopefully it's not too dark for me welcome it's to spin class catch off the light what does it look like y'all catch off the light mm -hmm. huh oh wavy catch off the light huh? i don't know y'all i don't know what it's giving babe what's my forehead looking like is it too dark What am I looking at? Okay. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> I'm sorry. Well, yeah, y'all, they had foam and then they had spray as well. Now, I have had this. I, ha I didn't have the spray kind before. My sister oh, had the spray kind, and I just used some of hers, and it was so sticky. Like, the spray kind was sticky, so I wanted to try this foam kind. So, that's what I got. We're going to see what it's hitting for. I got some Pump It Up. Y'all, you know, a little bit of spritz, super holy boom i feel like this is just the og i be going in the hair store they have so many different like spritzes and i'm just like i don't know what to get so i just either get the brown bottle or this one you know stick with what you know girl then i got this we even cool. yeah i got this even wonder lace bun so stay tuned because we finna get ready to do our hair then i got this Y'all already know a lot of body. I love a lot of body. And I have a bunch of collabs coming up with like curly wigs and stuff. So I already have a bottle, but I need a new bottle. And then I got the Ruby Kisses Cream Foundation because if you've ever ran across wig top or wig tube, then you know the girl is beyond Ruby Kisses Cream Foundation real bad. Now I've only had Ruby Kisses Cream Foundation for my wigs like one time and I got the shade 14 and then I got it another time in the shade 15 and it was just too dark. Like it just was too dark. And it's like 14 must be a popular seller because every time I go somewhere looking for it, they don't have it. But they had it today so i got it and then i got me a lip gloss it's just the nk makeup one i love these i usually get mine from ross or burlington but they had mango and i love anything mango and for carter hair i had to get some more jam because this is how i took his hair down people be asking but i use jam and then i just got two um brow archers because they was at the front counter and I needed some. And then I got a lip liner because y'all know I love a good little brown lip liner. And I already used it to see what it was hitting for. And it's real creamy and I really like it. And it was only a dollar. So, yeah. So, that is everything I got today at the beauty supply store. I just wanted to give y'all a little quick call. And I just came to the bathroom to see. Oh, it's not too dark. I mean, it got on my skin right there. But we clean that off. We looking at the lace, not the skin. Yeah. It's, ooh, girl. It's not too dark, you know, like it's not too dark. So I don't know y'all, and it was only like $6, I think. So but yeah, y'all, I love this wig. It just gives like mom vibes. I love the little blonde and black. Like I love the blonde and black wigs. What's it called? Bayage, Bella? Y'all know what I'm talking about. I love this style of wig versus like the just highlight with the like different tones of blonde. Like this just eats, like it just gives natural. I always wanted my natural hair dyed like this. 
and my mama would never let me. So, love a good wig. She's eating. She's gorgeous. But I'm about to go ahead, you guys. Go ahead and take out some meat later on for dinner. Welcome to the vlog. I forgot to show y'all what I got from Burlington. I got me a mini flat iron because I be I have been eating this for the longest, and then it was only twelve ninety nine. So I was like, let me scoop that because. Be needing this for like to make like the little fluffy edges on my wiggy, so I got that too. But yeah, all right, babes. I just came from the mailbox, so I got some PR. I got my Carter got a new iPad, he wants to tell y'all that. <laughs> and I got some PR, I got three packages, so I'm gonna just open these with you guys so we can see. What we got. Okay. Oh, I'm so excited. You're excited? I am. So I've been wanting one of these for the longest, y'all. And I got one from TikTok Shop. Oh so this is an electric God. scrubber. So y'all know, I'm gonna scrub the tubs. Everything gets scrubbed down tonight. It has three brush heads, one spin scrubber, and one adapter. It won't come off. And one adapter? Yep. Ooh. So that's the first thing. Then we got something else. I don't know what this is. It's so lightweight. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Why do they keep sending me these things from TikTok shop? Like this is the second one they sent me. Look, babe. Why I don't understand why they keep sending me that, y'all. I did not ask them. Like, why do they keep sending me that? I don't understand. We got one more item. Send me that junk. Okay, love. Oh, I, I literally oh. forgot about this, y'all. This ain't even for me. This for my husband. So I Go. Got, oh. Hot Nelly. I got him this like so long ago. It took forever in the day to come. <laughs> Should have checked the um, mailbox. Too, I probably got. Oh, I probably got stuff in there too. But it's just a black essential city. What? I'm mad because I really thought I had some good stuff down there. Girl, you ain't got nothing. Okay. So today is Saturday, you guys. I know I'm late on my uploads, but I have really just been busy, y'all. Getting prepared for the move, organizing, deep cleaning, decluttering. I've just been busy. So, picked up my camera today, finally, after two days, because my camera been dead. I ain't been charging it. Like, um, I've been tired, y'all. I've been on my Zoom. I feel like for October, I never gave y'all that many vlogs back to back to back to back. I was on my Zoom. But we're back, so welcome back, you guys. So I have some packages that I want to open with y'all. Let's open up these packages. So exciting. Ah. First thing I got is this um, OQQ set from TikTok shop. Y'all, literally, I have this already in another variation. I have it in tan. And now I'm like a mom. Y'all know, so the tan really wasn't that good for me because the kids kept getting stains on it. Like, it just was getting dirty. But I got the black one now, and I'm so excited. I'm gonna I'm gonna try it on for y'all in a minute. But I'm gonna put that on today because we're gonna go to the beach. So I'm gonna put that on today. And then the next thing I got, y'all, is also from OTQ. Period. They have the best like loungewear and stuff like affordable loungewear. You can find it on TikTok shop or you can get it on um, Amazon. Y'all, they got the affordable stuff. Look at these shirts. They such good quality. Look at that. Y'all can see that. So it came with a black one. I got a gray one, which is so cute. And these are perfect to wear like with like leggings, like workout leggings and stuff. Cause it's like that workout material. And then also came with a tan one. Perfect y'all. I could put these on with like a vest on top or something. Just beautiful. Love it. Then I got one more package. Oh, okay. I was about to say, what is this? Okay, so these are some more shirts, y'all. It's these little cropped workout shirt or workout set. So, look at this. How freaking cute, y'all. And y'all know I do not be in the gym, but I love loungewear. Like, I love, like, some cute to throw on, take my baby to school, go grocery shopping. So, I'm going to try this. I'm going to try this stuff on for y'all because, ooh, baby, maybe I should have got a medium. I think I'm going to, like, look at it. Who, who butt fitting in this? It's stretchy, but... No, it's that stretchy. 
let's try this stuff on y'all okay y'all this is the first outfit i feel like it's actually pretty cute like <laughs> only thing about it y'all i just feel like my body not right for it like look at my stomach like you can see all the postpartum goodies right there you know what i'm saying but like, look I hate the way my body be looking and stuff that's too tight. Cause Kate made me so big when I was pregnant that I just have so much extra skin. So I be feeling like when I'm wearing tight stuff like this, it just kind of show a little bit like too much right here. But you know what? Who finna sit up here and talk down on themselves? Girl, you look good. You look good in this outfit. You look good. So this is the first outfit, y'all. <laughs> let's try on the next one all right babes second outfit this is the oqq one it comes in a variation of four and i think they're like 40 dollars, y'all i already have this same variation like i told y'all like a beige is white beige white color but i really wanted the black one so this is the first variation with the one shoulder sleeve and the leggings so i sized up this time because last time i got a small and the leggings was just too tight on me right here so this time i got a medium and it's so comfortable y'all look and what I like, it's like really pulling me. Like it's snatching me in. Like I love like the tummy control that these leggings have. So 10 out of 10. I'm going to put the links to everything in the description. And you guys can get it off TikTok shop. Or you can get it from Amazon. But if you buy it off TikTok shop, I make like two dollars. So no commission. But let's try on the other variation. Okay. So this is the outfit in the second variation. Like I said, it's a four piece set. So it comes with all these four, all four pieces for like... 40 ish dollars and look at that y'all when i tell y'all the leggings are not see-through at all like what color drawers i got on i got on blue drawers so you cannot see my underwear through this and this is the same way with the other set and the other set white i can be wearing pink drawers you cannot see my drawers through the um the material and it's super stretchy and like i said i really love material that like pull me in even though i don't really like i like to wear stuff like this around the house like even if i'm just at home i still like to feel cute and look cute when i'm just at home so this kind of stuff i like to wear like around the house but i mean it's so cute and it's very very comfy and like i said i would recommend sizing up on this outfit just to give you like a little bit more room because when i got small the last time it was just like too tight on my stomach and i didn't like that but, rookie okay we'll eat in a car then all right babe so we have left home you guys it's a little bit later so i saw well me and my husband apparently saw the same tiktok we just decided to not send it to each other but we saw a tiktok where this man was putting everybody on to these ham sandwiches from honey baked ham i never knew honey baked ham actually sell food i was under the impression that they just pop up around the holidays and they only have like you know whole hams but no so we at Honey Baked Ham right now. He went in because I didn't want to get out with the kids. This is the video, y'all. Look. So I'm getting the ham classic, and then CJ's getting like, he getting something different. His got like onion pickles. I ain't want all that on mine. So I'm gonna give y'all a little review. We're gonna see what this food is hitting for. Cause that man on TikTok, baby, he made it seem like it was delicious. And I picked this over Chick-fil-A. And y'all know, I don't mess around with my Chick-fil-A. Like I still gotta go Chick-fil-A for the boys, cause they gotta get some lunch. But yeah, I don't play around when it comes to my Chick-fil-A. And I picked this over Chick-fil-A, so it better be him for some. Try these sandwiches. I'm gonna get the boys something to eat and then carter was asking to go to the beach and then my mama sent the boys some money for a toy so we're gonna have to take them to get a toy so we just decided since carter was requesting to go to the beach that instead of going grocery shopping we would skip going grocery shopping today and we'll just do that tomorrow and we'll have a beach day but that meant that we had to eat out today because we ain't had nothing to eat at the house so yeah that's what we finna do that's what's finna go on right now y'all and yeah I will see y'all when I get this sandwich. If I can show y'all what it's hitting on, what it's hitting for, I'll see y'all. My husband went and got us our honey baked ham, and then the girl made a mistake and put onion on my sandwich, y'all. So they gave me a free sandwich. So I can come back and get it, guys. Girl, I eat onion. You could have left that on there. You didn't even have to do all that. But 
I'm about to see. I don't know which one is mine and which one is his, but I'm so hungry. I'm hungry too. You hungry? Daddy going to go Chick-fil-A to get you something to eat right now. Of course, the first one I open is not mine. So this sandwich is pretty big and I think it was like $9. And so like I told y'all, I got the ham classic. So I'm gonna try this out and see what it's hitting for. Okay, the croissant look a little dry. Mm. Oh my Stop! God. I need Wi-Fi. Let me see. Stop. It's really good, y'all. But I'm gonna see if it's gonna fill me up. Y'all know I kind of got a big back. Mmm. <laughs> It's so good. It got my ear itching. Mm. It's really good. So, I got mine on a croissant roll. But this particular sandwich, I think it served cold. And I didn't want it cold. So, I asked for it hot. Like, I asked to get it heated up. Yeah. It's good. Mm. Mm. It even got tomatoes on it. And I don't even like tomatoes, but this the one right here. Maybe it's the day my taste buds finally stop being childish and start liking tomatoes. I don't know what it is, but baby, this busting solid ten out of ten. <laughs> All right, babe, so we are at the beach, you guys, yeah. and it is a mess. Every time we come, the kids, well, Carter uh, love to mess with these birds. Kay is petrified, and then, like, it's like a, what is it, a high tide day, so it's like a little bit of water over here, and then all the ocean is back there, so the kids been in this water right here. Kay went in there and basically sat down. We didn't come here to get soaking wet, so now he's soaking wet, and he's literally in a pamper. Let me show y'all. His toes don't have them toes. Kay is literally out here in his pamper, y'all, because his clothes on the stroller and they soaking wet so yeah carter stop abusing those animals stop throwing things at them stop nah. abusing what stop abusing the animals because if they come and attack you you're gonna be looking crazy right okay i want to buy a slingshot from the stove anyways y'all like i said we're just at the beach i think we've been here for like probably like an hour or so we probably leave in like 30 minutes or so just letting the kids burn some energy it's a nice day it's 68 degrees out here it's actually a little bit cold because your girl is a little bit <gasps> i'm a little bit cold i can't lie to you i'm a little bit cold y'all i'm a little chilly so yeah we just been sitting here it's been cool thing watching a little navy um planes car to stop okay pack it up Let's go. No! I have sand on my lip gloss. I told y'all to stop throwing things. We're finna go. Cause look at y'all mess you out here in this pamper. You got sand, oh! You got what? Sand in my eye. And you trying to put it on me? Yeah. 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 I'm All right, time yeah. to pack up so we can get ready to go. Dad, I'm gonna roll down too. No bad, it's cold out here. Like, okay. So, who the hell buried my keys in the sand? Had to been that baby child cage. Okay. Nobody else would have did that. <sighs> Alright, besties, we finna pack up and get ready to go. The sunset is so beautiful. I don't know if my camera picking it up. I'm gonna try to insert a picture because the sunset is most definitely giving majestic. I love a good sunset. I used to call myself a sunset chaser because I just be chasing them. They're beautiful. Cammy, come on, let's get dressed. Lord bless this mess. Bye. Good morning, you guys. So, it's the next day, y'all. It's like 9.45. And I just got up. I guess CJ and the kids been up, but I just got up. Not feeling good. Then, I stayed up, like, pretty late. I was trying to order Carter glasses, and this website just kept on tripping. So, I stayed up for forever trying to get his glasses ordered. And then, I did some editing and stuff. So, I'm a little bit tired, but it's another day. It's a good, blessed day, you know. God gave you another day, trying to get up rather shine. So, I'm about to start on my skincare routine. I don't know why my eyes hurting, y'all. 
it feels like I have a cut on my eye. It's weird. And y'all know I just went to the eye doctor Friday. And my eye was feeling like this and I told him, but he said he didn't see anything wrong. But now it feels even more like intensified. So I'm like, is it the lashes? What can it be? So I'm gonna have to like see what is tea with my eye because it's really irritated. But I'm about to go ahead and start on my morning time routine, get my face care done. CJ already handled the boys, so I can just focus on me. So let's go. All right, babe. So I done did my skincare. Skin is giving glowy. My skin is bouncing back from last month because y'all remember I had like a terrible breakout on my face, and you could still see the three little pimples that I had. Like I think that's like the worst breakout I've had in a while. So my Oh, I had one over here too. But my skin is trying to recover and bounce back from that. But the problem is I'm having trouble fading these dark marks. And I never really get dark marks. So I don't really know like what product to use to get them to go away. So what do, what do y'all use for dark marks? Because I just been using the snail moistening, the snail moisturizing cream, washing my face with Louis Pousse. At nighttime in the shower, I started washing my face with um the gold dial antibacterial soap because I've seen a lot of girls say it help with like hyperpigmentation and stuff like that. But I just feel like the marks not going anywhere. Like even when I put on my tinted moisturizer, the marks still show through my tinted moisturizer. Granted, it's not a full coverage foundation. It's not even a foundation. But who, like not me, I have marks that can't be covered by a tinted moisturizer. What do I need to put on these marks, y'all? Let me know because they're really getting on my nerves. I'm about to go ahead and clean up my room. Yesterday I did my Saturday reset. I deep clean. I did so much laundry yesterday, so we don't have to do none of that today. All I gotta do is clean up my room and wash the dishes from breakfast. So let's go ahead and knock that out and let's get dressed for the day. happy sunday you guys so i know i know i know i know i know y'all probably like zaria what is going on so a company sent me this wig y'all this is not this shit hurt my ear this is not the wig that we had agreed on right so the wig that i was supposed to send me they make braided wigs but it was something completely different it wasn't this okay i I got this wig and I was like oh my god this is the wrong wig so I told them and then they ended up telling me that was like some communication issues the other wig was out of style so they sent this instead I'm I'm not feeling it but I was like okay I'll try to finesse it you know I don't know if it just looks too perfect like the other wig is supposed to be box braids so I just feel like this looks too perfect and i told y'all this in the last vlog i showed y'all this wig like the wig i was supposed to get the company's called fancy vv and they make like box braid bohemian box braid wigs and that's what i was supposed to get but this just looks like too perfect and then also the cap size is too big for my head so i had to like finesse it and i was like kind of covering my ears and turning my ears and i don't really like it so this will be off today but i just put it on last night so that i could take some product photos for them and be done with this but yeah don't mind the hair y'all don't mind the hair we're not here for the hair we here for me so you guys it is 12 43 and i am about to head out so the boys woke up at like 4 a.m and their daddy was up with them so they're all in the house knocked out y'all we supposed to be going grocery shopping but the kids was fussy my husband was being hangry and cranky so i was like y'all just take a nap Y'all take a nap. Grocery shopping could wait another day or two. So I ended up taking out some chicken thighs because later I'm going to make some chicken and ch some chicken and potatoes. Something real simple. But, you know, I can finesse a dinner out of what we got. The kids got a few snacks. So they sleep. Long story short, we finna go to Target. I don't know if I'm going to Target. So I kind of want to go to Dick's Sporting Goods and then go to Home Goods and Marshalls. And I really want me some rolls from Texas Roadhouse, y'all. So I kind of want to go that way and then maybe work my way up to Target. I don't really know, but I just know I'm finna get out, finna just walk around in some stores, y'all, because listen, my kids and my husband been driving me crazy today. Like, they been driving me crazy, so. Just gonna get out the house, have some alone time, and of course bring y'all with me. 
So I'm gonna go ahead, pull up my GPS, and we finna get ready to go. Give me y'all hand. Thank you, Lord, for this day as we get ready to go. I pray that you keep me safe, Lord. Let, keep me protected while I'm out and about alone in this crazy world, Lord. Please let me make it to my destination safely. And please let me make it back home to my family safely, Lord. In the name of Jesus, we pray. Amen. Y'all know that prayer is essential. I do not move my car without praying. I told y'all, I, I don't move my car without praying. I don't play that. Oh! To my butt, and these niggas trying to see what's up. Ah, ah, ah. <sighs> Not my song popping on soon as I cut the radio on. I love this song, but yes, y'all. I'll see you guys at the store. Bye, babes. So, please let me know why I got all the way to home goods, y'all. Ain't got no wallet, no budget binder, no cash, like no means of payment. So <laughs> So, I'm back at home. Hopefully, the kids are still sleeping. If they're still sleeping, I'm going to just get my wallet. We're going to hit the road again, but if they're up, I'm stuck. So, let's go and see what, what, what it's going to give. Because I done gave crazy as hell. Like, how you leave the house with no money, no wallet, no license, no identification? Just no nothing, girl. So, home goods is so packed, y'all, they don't even have babies. And I didn't find anything that I really wanted. So, we can just ready to head to the next place. I want to do like a gallery wall in the entryway of the house with something like this, but I want them to be bigger than that. But yeah, just bringing my Pinterest board to life. Y'all know the vibes. And I got some cute mirrors, but if I buy a mirror right now, I'm sure to be broke by the time we move. Not us in the mall. I don't think we've ever been to the mall on this channel. Y'all know I hate the mall. But in here today, girl, and I got the coins. I'm just some shit that I want in here, so I'm like real head up out of here. I was just like earrings, though. Here I go, who? All right, you guys, made it back into my car. Like I was telling y'all, I don't think we've ever been inside of a mall together on my channel. If you guys are new here, I am a girly who struggles really badly with anxiety and crowded places like malls and stuff it just makes me anxious so even if i only went to two places in the mall still a giant step for me because i never go to the mall i wanted to go to victoria's secret but victoria's secret was way too packed i wanted me some new underwear but it was way too packed in there so yeah i started getting a little bit anxious because there was like a bunch of like homeless people in there and that was like harassing this one girl who's in front of me and it got it made me so anxious so i kind of hit a mean ass sprint out of the mall which is why i'm out of breath but we did it girl so our my kids are up so i'm gonna head home we were supposed to go to the store but it's not happening today it's not happening i still gotta go ahead and prep carter for the new school week and everything it's not happening today but we're gonna go ahead oh i'm gonna go get me some rolls from texas Roadhouse house for sure because Girl, I'm over here by Texas Row House. It's no way, no way in the world I'm leaving from over here without some of them delicious rolls. So let me go ahead and back out. And yeah, I'm gonna head over here. Give me some rolls and then I'm gonna go. So this mall, y'all, this is probably the smallest mall in San Diego because it's so small. It's like an indoor outdoor type mall, but it's a mall. So the mark the mall is called Parkway Plaza. I think this is like 25 minutes away from my house. But I live closer to some like the bigger malls. And if y'all been watching me for a while, y'all know we go to Fashion Valley a lot. Like, Fashion Valley is, like, it's, like, an outdoor mall. But, like, indoor, outdoor, but Fashion Valley is, like, where all, like, the high-end stores are at and stuff. So, like, Rolex, Louis, Gucci, Prada, um, all the, all the high-end stores out there. And you'll see, like, a lot of famous people out there, too. We be going out there a lot because I like to go to Zara and they have kids, Foot Locker and stuff. But that's the only, like, mall mall we ever really go to so yeah for me to go like inside of a mall and be alone it was really big for me and i'm really proud of myself because i just be so freaking anxious y'all people just be so crazy like is something on top of my car does this sound like it i don't even go to the mall like back at home because like the people just be crazy it just be making me anxious but 
nevertheless we did it and i'm proud of myself i did buy me some um i bought some gold hoops and some silver hoops from forever 21 that's all i got from forever 21 because they had some cute stuff in there don't get me wrong but like they like the cargo like the cargo joggers i got from burlington for nine dollars y'all they had like the exact ones in there but they had like chocolate brown they had a dark gray they had um like an olive green they had some cute colors but that was 29.99 i'm not paying it for a pair of sweatpants like because that's all it is sweatpants like they had some cute stuff but like that's why i don't really like going shopping in person because i feel like in the store everything be so much more expensive expensive versus if you just order online they usually have a lot of good coupons you can find just more sales online so that's i'm such an online girly shopping in person it just don't be doing it for me why does it sound like there's something on top of my car like i didn't know i didn't forget nothing on top of my car and i didn't got the texas roll house and there's no parking i'm getting these rolls one way or another so yeah oh here go park what is that on my car that sounded like that hold up y'all hold up hold up i'm gonna show y'all these earrings i got this pack 5.99 and then i got the um gold pack too 5.99 because i love big hoops like this this a good size but i love a, a big mega size hoop like and i haven't had none in a minute i usually get mine from the hair store but the hair store that i be going to they don't have hoops so i'm excited girl period <laughs> You can wear these every day. So let's run up here, let's get our rolls. I'll be right back. Welcome to the official last day of this vlog, you guys, because I am ending this vlog today. So we just picked up Carter from school. He had a great day at school. Right. Here's the first one. Thank you. Thank you. Ooh, purr. Cheers. Y'all already know the usual. Carter, can you please cut that iPad down? So why has it gotta be on one million? Because y'all already I'm know. So terrified the meat don't have Y'all know the vibes. Camera Ruby Crunch. Don't want to try nothing else. Because every time I try something else, it end up being nasty. And I just ain't got time to be wasting my money. So, we just got Starbucks. Now, we're going to go get some, some lunch. And then we're going to go to the grocery store. We've been supposed to go to the grocery store for Why three days, y'all. Thank you. Of course. Take it easy. Yeah, Literally, this morning, um, the kids was up at a crazy time in the morning. Just like they was yesterday. You got it my way, babe. Which is why we didn't go to the grocery store yesterday. And today we're really going to be pushing it. Like because I got a doctor's appointment at 210. And it's already 1150. So. And we got to go back track the cheaper look. Yeah. Unless you just want to. We can just get them some McDonald's. But you know how that go. I eat it. I ain't like that. But yeah. We're heading to the commissary. Yes, My husband got some. What you got babe? Apple crisp oat milk shake. Egg. Apple Crisp Oatmeal Shaking Espresso. Is it good? I taste the apple. Let me see. Ooh. Stop trying new stuff. I, <laughs> so I told you to stick to what you know. I need that to wake me up. That might well be black coffee. I taste oh. that apple. Ugh. Oh. Nice. Oh, oh no. That tastes like tart cinnamon with a little bit of oh child gave me the chills like i'd swallowed a pill with no water that's disgusting yuck you need to grow, need to grow up that's disgusting he's not gonna finish that y'all you wanna make a bet mm -mm. Oh. if i make a bet he's gonna chug it when he knows it's absolutely positively disgusting y'all know besties Get y'all camera ribbon crunch. You're gonna be just fine. You get espresso mixed in it if you want to. You know, a little charge up, boost up, pick me up. Mm-hmm. But yeah, I'm you gonna go. Get that. So you your yours ain't charged up or boost up. Some days I some days I do get it That's charged a charged up. Chocolate slush. It's nothing chocolate about it, baby. It's caramel. I'm gonna start back editing this vlog, y'all, because your girl is behind. So I'll see y'all in a bit. So I just got home. I had a doctor's appointment, you guys. So I came home to a bunch of packages and also a missed um, package slip from FedEx. And I think it was for a wig, y'all. I signed the thing for them to leave it at the door, but apparently they just decided not to leave it anyway. So let's go ahead, open up our wig. Let's see what we've got, because I'm pretty sure it's all wigs. So this first one is from OQ Hair. 
I have a lot of collabs coming up. Ooh, have a ton of collabs coming up for um what is this month coming up? November girl. Ooh. Okay, so OQ Hair sent me this really cute. It's like a honey blondish color. Let me show y'all. It's glueless, of course. And it's just like a little golden color, something real cute, real cute. Her, we love a good little blind number. And I'm gonna do some crimps in this. I feel like it's gonna be so cute. And this is, this is a 24 inch straight unit. Like, I'm on these blues units real bad. The past two units that you guys saw me wear in this vlog, the red and the braided unit, those are frontal, frontal units. I'm just not really here for the whole frontal thing and whole blue thing. Like, who wants to do all that? Who who wants to do all that? All that extra work. Like, I don't want to. Okay, y'all. This is right here. It's from IC. And it's actually, I have like three collabs coming up with IC. So they wanted me to do like three separate like videos for them. And I just love IC's packaging. It's just like a luxury unboxing. You take the cap off and it's like this beautiful silver and hot pink. And then it just, everything about it screams luxurious. I think their packaging is so freaking amazing. So this is a 28 inch waterway unit. So it's very similar to the last IC unit that I had, but this one is 28 inches and it's really pretty. So we're gonna put this one back in the bag. I'm not even gonna open it because, yeah, my husband bringing the groceries up. I just got a whole lot, a whole lot of going on. I just wanted to do this with y'all because y'all know I like to open up PR and stuff with y'all. <sighs> so we have another one. I wonder who sent theirs through FedEx. I think it's this company called Julia here. I think theirs was through FedEx. And so, yeah, I was gonna go pick it up because it said that I could come pick it up at five. So I thought, I thought they took it to like the local FedEx, like closest to me, but they took it to the one like way across town, y'all. With traffic, it's gonna take me 30 minutes to get there and I can't go because I'm taking the boys to a Chick-fil-A trunk or tree event at five. I'm gonna have to still get the boys a little basket to hold their candy so I can't go away over there. I just have to wait till tomorrow. But we have another unit from IC. And this unit is a, um, okay, this is an 18 inch and it's a kinky curly and it is also glueless. So yeah, I usually don't do my um, wig stuff on YouTube unless I'm just doing like a collaboration strictly for YouTube. I'll just show the item in the YouTube video, but I don't really like give you guys like a whole little video because I have the charge companies for them because they be wanting dedicated YouTube videos for like that. And then they'll be like, they want it for 10 minutes and all they want to give you is a free wig. No, I need money. So we have another package. This one is from FedEx. This is what I don't be understanding. How you gonna leave two packages and take one? Come on now, come on. But this one here is from Wiggins Hair. And this is their 22 inch, I think it's straight. Yeah, 22 inch straight glueless. So we have a bunch of wig content coming up, y'all. We have a bunch of wig content. And I'm pretty sure the other, like I said, the other package that they took, I'm pretty sure that's a wig. And I don't know what this one is. It's so flat. Oh, this is also a wig. This one is from who is this from? Amanda Hair? Nobody, I, I haven't talked to no company named no Amanda Hair. Let me see. Oh, get a hair. I'm about to say Amanda Hair. Miss Girl, I don't remember us talking, but this is a, I wanna say this is a 24 inch straight. And so I'm gonna have to start like doing like real styles with these wigs because they all be like the same. Okay, my camera decided to stop. I don't know what's the last thing y'all saw. I got another glueless straight unit. So I got five wigs in the mail today. It was supposed to be six, but we're gonna go pick that other one up. But yeah, y'all, let's go ahead, put this stuff up. I will be back, you guys. All right, besties. So it is much later in the day, you guys. So earlier we took the boys to a little like ball, Halloween, trick or treat, trunk or treat thing that was at like our local Chick-fil-A. And they had fun, but y'all know, 
I, I think I told y'all the boys were up at like freaking 3 a.m. last night. So the boys were tired, y'all. They were super freaking tired. So they started getting fussy and everything. So we ended up leaving, but they still had a good time. So tomorrow is Halloween. Carter's school has like a parade, like a Halloween parade. So we have to get there pretty early so that we can secure a parking spot because parking is a big issue at Carter's school. So we're gonna do that tomorrow. I know that I have been behind on my vlogs. I haven't posted in four days, which like, oh my God, girl, what have you been doing? But honestly, y'all, I'm gonna tell y'all what I've been doing. I've been stressing and how you gonna stress and trust God. It don't work like that. Like you can't do both. So basically, we just been having like a lot of meetings and stuff coming up about our move, about our home, about my husband. I told you my husband's been out of the military. So we just been having like a lot of meetings and just a lot of stuff going on lately. On top of trying to create content, also doing these meetings and having family time, keeping time. For Hi, Carter. What's the matter? Uh, I'm, just... I'm okay. Get, you can get in mommy bed. We just been having a lot going on. So basically, I just have been running out of time. Haven't really been having that much time to edit. So I made sure I sit down and edit this video tonight so that it can go up tomorrow. I love you guys. And I will see you guys in the next video. Love you besties. Mwah. Bye, babes.